Hey guys, I'm Henry. Welcome back to the Shrek Gaming as we work through our way of... That was not English. As we work our way through Monster Rancher card battle or battle card, whatever. Alright, like I said, in order to make up for the GameCube being gone, we are going to, uh, you know, try to get this guy out a few episodes. Uh, anyways, good timing! Would you battle with me? Sure, random encounter. I'll battle with you. Toss a coin. Okay. So, I've actually been thinking a lot about this game, uh, like, in, as a system lately, and, like, thinking about how it goes. Hey, I am the first! Sweet. Um, and I'll try and get into that as I explain, like, my decisions this battle. Um, first off, I just want to look at those monsters really quickly after he guts us up, does whatever he needs to do. Alright, so let's have a little look at what's going on there. So we got, these are ours. He has Pixie, who seems interesting, is in the air. Very interesting. We have another tiger, and then we have Dino, yeah. Actually, because it's in the air, does that mean that... Because the other guys don't even have, like... Is in the air, okay. I'm not sure what that means. Maybe there's some... There's something where, like, ground types, like, can't hit air, or... I, I don't know. I'm not really gonna ask questions at this stage. So... What I was saying was... Um... Yeah, I've been thinking a lot about how this game actually functions, and I have come up with some conclusions. Uh, you may or may not be interested. Uh, I don't want to use that because I want to. I want to blaze wall next turn, right? Yeah, I want to blaze wall next turn. So we're just not going to do anything. Uh, gonna end our turn and then. That's literally everything. Uh, that's fine. So, this is the other thing I need to get better at. I need to get better at multitasking so that when I'm actually telling a story or something where I'm talking about something, I can the gameplay can continue while I tell it, and I just don't get distracted halfway through and then have to restart it a little bit later. Um, in any case, so, think about this, and I've thought, I've noticed that there are a few things do that stand out. One, this gut system is very, very interesting because essentially what happens is that, uh, okay, that's fine. So what happens is that this becomes a battle of resources, right? This becomes a battle where you're trying to either expend your resources more efficiently than your opponent, or you're just trying to expend more resources than your opponent, and in so doing, beat them. Right? Because every Guts is exactly one card. And that's kind of important, because it means that uh, a card can be useful because it has Guts efficiency, right? So Scratch is a very Guts inefficient card, whereas Blazewall, because uh, Scratch is one for one, but Blazewall is four for six, if I hit it properly. Which is uh, pretty ideal. So we're just gonna do this really quickly while I describe what I'm talking about. And so, one strategy is that you want to be as efficient as possible. Man, that wasn't really a wall as much as just kind of like a little spout. But I'm not gonna ask questions. In any case, so that's kind of important because it means that certain things work out differently, right? So. In a game like Magic, or in a game like Hearthstone, or, um, I don't know, I guess even like Duel Masters or anything like that. In a game like Pokemon, even. Because energy, uh, gets to be reused, right? Um, admittedly, like, it's not always called energy, but whatever you want to call it, like, mana, the thing that you use to pay for cards gets reused. That means that... It's an entirely separate resource from your deck. Now, this is less true in Magic and Duel Masters and those sorts of games because the mana are actual cards, but because you can reuse them, it doesn't feel like, you know, like you're using up resources when you do things like that, right? Um, 
this is entirely not the case for this game, right? Because every card is exactly one resource. It's either it's either like paying the one-time cost for another card, or it's a card that's being played. And so, that just means that you have to interact with things differently. Um, like wasting mana in a turn of Hearthstone or whatever, like it's not necessarily good, but it's not like it's anywhere near a catastrophe. Like you're gonna be perfectly fine. And um, what was I gonna say? Uh, yeah, yeah, no, like you're gonna like it's not as if you're losing out on serious tempo or anything like that, or like serious value just because you're missing some mana one turn because you didn't have a, the right card for it or whatever. This is not the case with this game, because whenever you do not expend a resource, you are effectively not using that resource and also denying yourself the additional card draw next turn, right? So it's like every single card that you choose to keep costs you two guts, if we think about it, right? Because at the very minimum, you missed out on gutting that card, and you also miss out on gutsing the card that you would have drawn because you had an empty space in your hand. And that makes things like holding out for combos really a difficult to make decision, and oftentimes I think not worth it. Um, so, like, uh, how do I put this? So the fact, okay, I got a <laughs> pixie shotgun. Okay, so uh, that fairy succubus looking lady just has a shotgun. Tiger's right claw, left claw, okay. Um, but what I was saying, that is a big mushroom. I have no idea what that's gonna be like. Um, was there a path up here? No, there wasn't. Okay, I gotta go around. In any case, what I was saying was, uh, you wanna draw your real strength? Uh, sure? I don't know what that means, but I'm sure it's fine. And I just got distracted again because the game did something weird. Okay, alright, tail size, whatever. So, uh, what was I describing? I was describing, right, the resources. And so, that's why I think something like, uh, Tiger's right claw, left claw, and horns, right? But you look at that, it is a three card combo that can do seven damage for zero guts, which seems insane, but you also have to consider how much guts you're missing out to hold for the attack. So I'm gonna assume that Let's just say you're, you 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 drop like super super well, so you keep your left claw, you keep your right claw, and then next turn you draw the horn. So that's three cards. I'm gonna I'm gonna say that you expend you lose out on two guts in the playing of the combo, uh, simply because you know like uh, how do I put this? Like uh, first of all, wait, how much damage does this guy do? This guy does two, right? Um, or does two, but it kills the guts, which is absolutely insane. Okay. Uh, so we're gonna end. But, so anyways, for assuming optimal choices, you have a left claw, your right claw, you hold on to them. So, you spend two cards because you're using three cards to stack instead of one, so that's two guts. And you lose out on arguably six, up to six guts for not gutsing and gutsing those cards and holding on to them. Even if we say that that's too harsh, you're still using 4 guts, and 4 guts for 7, while it's very good, the fact is you also just won't be able to do it that often. And so, suddenly it's actually not that good. Headbutt. Alright, he's headbutting me. Hair attacks, headbutt. Okay. That's a nice little animation. This game clearly has some thought put into it. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, okay, and then we're gonna get killed by the breeder help. I'm just gonna punch my dude. In any case, what was I talking about? I I genuinely don't even remember. Um, but yeah, I guess that was kind of the end of that thought. Like, there are certain things that seem very good on paper, and that if the gut system did not work the way it did... Oh my god! Did you just seven me off of two guts? Are you kidding? <laughs> All right, that just happened. Sweet. Um, in any case, uh, 
A lot of these are use are just straight up useless cards. I'm not gonna lick him because I don't get anything out of it. Um, yeah, that really sucks. I'll just use this to kill that for now. In any case, yeah. But the point I'm trying to get at is that the gut system. I've been thinking a lot about it, and things that I would traditionally consider pretty good, even though you have to assemble a combo for it. Like it just becomes not not good. What pretty much whatsoever. Once you realize that, like, you, you know, you have to spend cards, and by holding on to cards for later, you're missing out on resources and all these sorts of things. Can you stop thundering me, Miss Pixie? So my opponent only has cards that do- that it costs zero or something stupid. Alright. Now I'm happy to gut. Okay. Now look at this, right? This exchange right here. This look cost me four- four guts plus a card to play it, right? So that's five cards to get rid of four cards and then also deal two damage. That's... that's... that's like a win right there, right? That is a successful exchange in on my half because, like, he's losing four guts, I had to pay four guts, and then I just got to pay, essentially, a zero guts card to lick him. That's pretty good. And that's not even considering the fact that by getting rid of those guts for him, I'm basically prohibiting him from doing anything next turn. Which is pretty crazy. We're gonna kill this wolf so that he doesn't just draw into some right claw, left claw bullshit. Um, yeah. Because this is a card game, and so, even though, uh, you know, like, even though this isn't the, quite the RNG fiesta that, um, Pokemon is, you're still RNG in the card draw or whatever. It does but that doesn't really matter. I'm just complaining now. Um, point is, uh, I will keep that, I guess, uh, in case something horrible happens. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, uh, gut system, interesting, especially how it interacts with the, uh, refill mechanic, uh, I guess, is, the, that was the point of that whole thing. Um, I don't see how the fact that the pixie is in the air has done literally anything this game. And I also haven't seen how it does anything to my, um, whatever he's called, the sun dude. Actually, I'm kind of curious, what was... Uh, no, I want to look at my foes. So yeah, he just has a whole bunch of scratches which are just zero for ones, I guess, right? Yeah, just pixie attack card. Yeah, that, that all looks fine. What the heck is... Computing. Hair, spe oh, so hell, hair is good at computing. Guts zero. Discard one and take two anew. Yeah, that's a very poetic way to put it. Um, but that's also good because that's like graceful charity. Um, in any case, we are going to kill our opponent uh, by stabbing them. Stabbing this succubus. Okay, or pixie, whatever the heck it's called. Those are demon wings. Those are, those are not like pixie wings, right? Pixie wings look like either butterflies or dragonflies, or that's just... Th those are bat wings. That's not what that looks like. Alright, I won. Tiger's Charge. Hair's Headbutt. Mango. I got a mango. Uh, not really. I, I just kind of want you to get out of this, out of my way. Um, I'm just kind of... I'm trying to look around. Um, where's the map? Here's the map. I think there's something up here. If we walk all the way around. Never mind, there's literally nothing. Okay. Yeah, alright, that's... whatever. Okay. I'm not- again, I don't know what the mushroom does. I guess these are just supposed to be different tile sets to kind of vary it up. Um... Uh, Miss, will you play with me? Why'd you call me Miss? I'm like nine years old. That, that doesn't make any sense. Alright. So, I don't know. I think at some point, if I ever get any proper video editing software, because this is just all coming out unedited. Like, you know, I test it. I am the last. Uh, you know, I test it out, make sure that the audio levels aren't horrendous and stuff like that. But after that, I just kind of let it go. Oh my god, that's what Sweezy looks like from the front. That's... Kind of horrifying. Um, yeah, we're 
to save us two guts. Uh, there is no way we are ever going to play Bite or Tongue. I, t I might be able to play Bite. I I don't like the Mango. I I think it's kind of useless. Um, because why you know why heal yourself when you can just kill your opponent and all that. Um, I don't think the Reflect is any good either, honestly. But we can only guts too, so this is fine. Oh, he's gonna freaking slap me with his penguin kappa looking thing. Uh, with mochi. Yeah, slap. <laughs> that is a slap. <laughs> he just slapped my wolf in the face. That's horrible. Um, got a right claw. Yeah, again, like the right claw is so not good. Um, I guess I could use it to kill. The opponent, yeah. Uh, I'll, cause I'm gonna kick... I think I'm gonna kick the pixie in the face. Like, even though I know Sweezo is capable of some major bullshit. Um, we're just gonna kick the succubus to get it down. And then we'll, um... Yeah, we'll right claw it, and then we'll just nix everything else, so that then we can have some energy next turn. All these defense cards are super expensive, apparently. Right? Like, the wolf's ones are fine, it's cheap. It's one for a dodge, and then two for a dodge plus a double attack, which is kind of insane. But, like, this guy, it's three for a dodge, and... Does that do a dodge, actually? I thought it did it. Uh, yeah, okay. If reflects wise skill damage... Ignore special effects. Okay. Now... I thought for a second that this meant reflect wise skill damage and it was some weird English thing. I think wise is supposed to be translated as smart here, so when it's a smart skill. So this thing is super situational and like it costs. I don't know, I hate some of these cards. Uh, guts is short. <laughs> is that what it just said? Guts is short, people. Guts is short. Uh, oh god, we're getting headbutt. Deck card is not available. I have no idea what that means. I'll check it out in the discard in the dumped pile later. All right. Yeah, yeah. Hit my wolf in the face, and then punch it with breeder after that. Even though that can't be used to finish anything off. Yeah. Just there you go. He's dying. Ooh, I got a left. I got a left claw. That's kind of cool. Um. Anyways, let's look at. Not slap. Headbutt. Headbutt. Guts 2, damage 3. That's all it means. No... Oh, no deck card means I have no cards in my hand so I can't defend. Okay. That makes sense now. Um, it probably shouldn't make sense because it's still rather nonsensical. Uh, we are gonna take down Sweezo before he can do any bullshit. Because I know what Sweezo is capable of. He's capable of some extreme bullshit, and I do not like it. I do not like having it played against me. You know, I... I forget if I mentioned this last episode, but... Suizu! By depriving the opponent of the resources. That's kind of an unfun mechanic in some ways. Because... You're essentially, like... We're under the fundamental assumption that playing cards is fun. You're depriving your opponent of having that fun, right? Like... <laughs> just kind of... Annoying, but at the same time, I do kind of like how it adds like a little bit of counterplay and like timing and stuff. And the fact that you have to time it means that it's even harder to play correctly because timing is so difficult in this game to judge, in my opinion. Alright, he's gonna slap probably my wolf, slap him in the face, and just kill him, which is fine. Um, but yeah, no, I, I am actually kind of remembered with Suizo with. It almost feels kind of like one of those deck out cart, uh, you know, things you'd have where, like, you in Yu-Gi-Oh, you know, you'd run stuff like order level defense B and like uh, gravity. What is it? Gravity zone or like I think it might just be called gravity bind, something like that, where you just prevent your opponent from playing cards. Oh, I can only attack once with the breeze. Okay, that's fine. I'll. Okay, we made a mistake. I thought this that costed nothing for some reason. Um, 
clearly it doesn't. Uh, so we're just gonna... We're just gonna do that. So I, I have to kill next turn, unless he mangoes or does something stupid. Oh god, he's going to thrust! Thrust against my... Against Suizo or against the... Against the... I still can't remember what this guy is. It's like... It's two syllables, four letters, consonant vowel, consonant vowel. Um... What is his name, actually? His name is Galley. Okay, Galley. They thought that there was an A in it, but I wasn't sure. Alright, let's spit at our opponent. Quick two. God. This, this guy is just... <laughs> his attacks all involve, like, spit... Like, the only reasonable one is, like, tail lash and, like, bite. Like, those are attacks. The other ones are, like... He just, like, licks. Or, like, spits. Also, I'm a dumbass and didn't do that first. Okay, we're just... <laughs> I'm sorry, I keep- I'm not paying attention because I keep on, like, getting distracted trying to talk about other stuff. Um, I am BMing my opponent massively right here, but, yeah, it's okay. Alright, he recovered his life, nice job. Uh, so I guess, you know, now I think I understand. Whenever people on YouTube or whatever complain, it's like, oh man, it's really hard to do commentary and also play well. Because you're telling a story and then you get distracted, like I just did several times. But hey, it didn't matter. He stole basically one, because there's no way he was gonna recover from that. Lose win. Alright. One! Mochi's slap will be mine. Mochi's slap will be mine. I got another copy of Sli Side Roll. <laughs> you want the treasure. Um. I'm nowhere near the treasure, dude. I kind of just wanted to walk around and, like, see what was up. I, I, it's difficult to beat me. Um, <laughs> okay, I don't understand this game, actually, I think. I think I understand the card game now, but I do not understand the, like, the setting at all. I don't, I, <laughs> what the fuck? I, <laughs> what the fuck? Um... Uh, I'm gonna get rid of that. Keeping back roll could be useful. But actually, no, fuck it. We're just gonna... We're just gonna try and kill our opponent. Um, which I think is a good strategy. Okay, he's gonna mango someone. Alright, he mangoes his naga. His little snake. It looks kinda like one of those... It looks kinda like a spectrobe, honestly. Which is... I don't even know if people know what spectrums are anymore. Like, it wasn't that long ago, but at the same time, it was also, uh... I don't know, I don't know the last time anyone's done spectrums. I mean, they had the DS games, they had the game on the Wii, I think there was, like, one other one that I didn't end up getting. Alright, we are gonna expend all our resources to kill Swayzo before he can do some bullshit. Um, which... Might not be a good idea in the long run, but I also do not want Suizo to be active for my opponent because there's so much bullshit. So this is just gonna happen. Yeah, but Spectrum. I don't know. I'll have to check up on it. I quite like the series. I thought it was kind of cool. Um, another. For those of you who don't know, it was kind of like one of those. Um, I guess it's like a Monster Rancher game. Not like this, but. You know, an actual Monster Rancher game where you would, um, you know, raise Spectrobes. Like, there is, it was kind of interesting, because, um, the Spectrobes are all fossils. And so, like, you have to dig up the fossils first and dig up these minerals for them to eat. And then you can start, like, doing stuff with them, like, you know, playing or, uh, powering them up. And I guess it is kind of like Pokemon, because they have three forms and all that. Uh, but, I don't know. I thought it was quite a bit of fun. I do not want to deal with any dodging bullshit, so I'm just gonna kill Naga. Oh god! He countered. Does that mean that I get hit, or does it just mean that there's a counter? Ow! Okay. Skill was reflected. Oh, so I guess that's what that does. So I, I took half damage and he took half damage. So like, okay, that's fine. Uh, I think I'm gonna keep the stab. 
so that I can just kill some people uh, next turn. I do like the guarantee of being to kill people, so... And yeah, that's the thing, like, I could have just guts that and then assumed that I would have gotten the materials to kill, but because I'm a coward, uh, I don't trust, and I don't trust anything like that to happen. Um, we're just gonna, you know, have to be inefficient for the consistency, I guess. And that's a pretty interesting way to put it, like, it's kind of like, uh, like, you know, you have, like, your Fourier transform and then your normal parameters where increasing, like, decreasing the width of one increases the width of the other, and so as your certainty of what you know that you can do increases, like, your card efficiency just plummets because card efficiency is all about engutsing literally everything in your hand at the end of the turn so that you always draw five and you're always being hyper-efficient. Uh, we're gonna get pierced because I don't have a deck card available. Ooh, that was kind of a cool little thing. Poke, poke. One of those things. And then he's gonna guts. Uh, oh, I got horn left claw. So hopefully this kills him. Um, we're gonna, we should probably lead off with the kick. Just so that, um, if he blocks, he'll probably block that first. Because I don't know. I, I expect AI to not be particularly advanced, because this is a Game Boy Color game, and... Yeah, I don't know, the file size was not particularly large, uh, for the Game Boy Color. The combo with that. There we go, that should kill him. And, like, I don't know. I'm winning, because my opponents all have, like, they all take three damage at the beginning of the game, because this is the first area, I guess. And you're supposed to still be figuring out how to play. In any case, we won. Go ahead. Golem's Clutch, Golem's Clutch, Golem's W Chop. He didn't have any of those cards. None of those were his. Mo Down. <laughs> Mo Downer. What on earth is that? For battle, affects enemy, decreases life from two monsters. Okay. Are these guys just like hanging out? What? I'll show you a real battle. Oh, no thank you. Um, I I'm kinda good on battles, bro. I'm just trying to figure out where the exit is now. Well, it's not over here. Is that like a special tile? Is it a sprout? No? Okay. You just move. Yeah, I guess some of these guys, you don't actually have to- Ooh! Oh, this definitely doesn't look booby-trapped. Um, looks perfectly good. No ground, what now? Yeah, how am I supposed to get there? Huh. Maybe there's something else, like, deeper in the cave that I can use? Or maybe there's some sort of item that, like, will, um, whatever you call it. That'll make it so that then you can get in there. Well, there's a staircase. Uh, I want to see if there's something I can do about that, though. It doesn't look like it. Um, so this is just gonna happen. No, I'm really curious. Is this like a, is this like a mystery dungeon game? Because this map looks kind of randomized. It looks a lot like the mystery dungeon map from the Pokemon spinoff. No, uh, no, no, go downstairs. Go downstairs. B2F. Okay. Because yeah, this looks quite randomized. Which, I th I don't know, I think that's pretty cool. If somehow on a Game Boy Color game, you got a sophisticated roguelite engine to develop... Oh, hi there. I, I, I do want the treasure. Um, so I guess this is going to happen. Alright. Guardian just takes the first attack, so I am the last. But that's okay. I don't mind being the last. No. I'm actually kind of curious, is scouting any good, like, whatsoever, right? Because scouting, it lets you look at his hands, and you also get to draw a card. I, 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 I think it might be good, I don't know, because your opponent's hand is constantly changing, so I'm not sure how useful, like, that sort of information is. Um... I think I'm just gonna nix it and 
Uh, item all for now, because I'm not going to use either of those. Alright, uh, he's going to gut everything. Man, this guy is confident. So, I guess I, I'm going to have to do something similar. Let's kill the Kappa guy. Uh, just because I'm pretty sure I'll be able to kill him next turn. Right? Yeah. Galio attacks! Kick! Punch. Or, yeah. Drop the kick on him. He shakes side to side in visible rage as he takes two hit points. No, we're gonna copy our opponent. We're gonna be balls. We're just gonna guts everything. Because I need guts to do stuff. And, I don't know, gutsing the first term. Oh my god! Okay, he's just gonna knee kick Suizo and kill him. Alright. Well, I guess that's like my dude's flame. It's not like bullshit, it's just. Wow, that's powerful, you know? <laughs> okay. So we're gonna. Even though it's a little deficient, we're gonna bolt the, the stupid guy. Um, Kappa. Uh, I don't know, I guess he- I don't know, Mochi, that's his name. We're gonna call him Mochi, because he's not really a Kappa. He's more like a penguin than a Kappa, but he has that thing on his head. Um, so I always associate it like that. Alright, so we're gonna end our turn. Because I know I'll be able to kill someone next turn with flame, I'm gonna keep it. So then, yeah. I'll just be able to, like, destroy his golem, assuming I don't get killed right here. Punch. I was just gonna punch the wolf, that doesn't matter. Yeah, punch the dog, he doesn't matter, but... Gotta keep my abstract thing with a sun god mask alive. Yeah, what on earth is he? He has a weird thing, alright. I don't know, maybe I should play like the actual Monster Rancher game at some point. Because, I don't know, these monster designs seem really weird. Some of them are very very generic. Some of them are kind of cool, some of them are just kind of, eh. You know, neither here nor there. Um, I don't know. I'll have to think about it. I definitely don't- oh my god! <laughs> oh god, this is actually gonna be kind of close, because my opponent just double knee kicked my, my entire team. Okay. Uh, okay, so we're going to do everything we can. We need to mango so that I don't die from a two for three. Whatever it's called, the freaking like, not the knee kick, the claw or whatever it's called. So, I don't think I can do that. Yeah, I already did my move. We're going to have to left claw and hope that he just doesn't have it. Right? He has, I think, three? Three guts? Which is unideal. Uh, guts is show- What? <laughs> guts is short. Oh. <laughs> that was a strange graphical bug. Um. Okay, so we're gonna end. Now we have to guts, so. The question is, do I keep this health? It means that I win if I draw bolt. But also gives me a smaller chance of drawing other attacks. I, I think I'm gonna keep it. It's because I have six guts, like... We're, we're gonna survive. Ah, oh, we got charged! Aw, oh, man. I got beat by an opponent with a severe handicap. That's pretty bad. <laughs> Ugh. Alright, so I guess... I guess I lose cards now. You're too weak. Get out. One dungeon counter gone. How many dungeon counters do I have? Um... Oh, at the bottom right there, okay. Downer will be mine! Okay. Let's just keep on... Keeping on. Alright. That was kinda sucky. Hey there, buddy. Are you Aya? Let's battle, yeah. I'll battle you, strange blue-haired kid. Hopefully this will be less intense than the severe beating I just got. 
<laughs> Which, honestly, I don't know. The same shit would have happened if I... Oh, the last. If he had full health, just because his crazy... No, I, I don't like just chalking it up to luck. That was some pretty insane luck where he just... Where he just, like, did shit, and then I just got killed. Um, right, like, like, those two knee kicks. That would have killed me no matter what. Oh, God. Looks like the AI is learning. It's not so good. Uh, because I kind of need the AI to suck. I guess the dinosaur is the real, is the is the big uh, threat, so I'm gonna just take him down because he just does so much damage. All right, we're gonna hit him in the face. We're gonna. But I almost don't want to use a horn, but using a horn means that pretty much every other attack will kill him next turn. And then we're gonna gut everything. And he's gonna draw a freaking knee drop or whatever the hell it's called, and I'm gonna <laughs> get bodied again. Uh, that's what's gonna happen. Spin cut? What on earth is that? That is that just <laughs> spin cut? Oh well, I guess Squeezo's dead. Oh my god! What is with these draws where you just draw high shit and I sh and you just can't guard against it? Um. I mean, I guess the idea is that you have to keep guard moves and stuff, because it's actually not that good if you don't have to, you know. Alright. Okay, so a few things. We're gonna bolt that. Tiger uses bolt. He's dead. Yay, yay, yay. He's dead. Bit inefficient there, but honestly, that's fine. So we're not gonna be able to use flame next turn, so that means that we definitely want to... Okay, we're gonna, and we're definitely going to nix all of that. I'll keep the Reflect in case we get targeted again. I think, yeah. That should be fine. I think I'm happy doing that. Alright, we're going to use Help. Uh, I don't care about Help. That's just one point. Owie. Oh, oh man, it looks like he's not targeting my Suizo, or whatever, my Molly, Sula, Malu, what the hell is he called? Uh, Galley, Galley, Molly was really close, okay. Okay, so I'm actually gonna nix the Reflect now that I can get a lie down, which is a bit more consistent. I'm gonna use the stab to just kill this guy. It looks like he didn't defend. Stab! Just shiv him! Right? He's got mm, killed. Alright, I'll keep the lie down in case- I don't know. At this point, I'm so close to winning. No, no, no. I don't- I don't want something stupid to happen here. I don't want anything stupid to occur, so we're gonna- we're gonna play safe. Hey, look, it appears. Uh, I can't use that because he's attacking the wrong guy. Yeah, that's the other thing that's annoying about defense cards. You have to assume that your opponent is attacking the right person, and then suddenly it becomes useful. Uh, otherwise it's just like a dead card in your hand or whatever, and doesn't do anything. Well, it's good that I drew all of my not useful cards. I guess... In order to try and kill him, we're just gonna drop everything we have and use that blaze wall inefficiently. Just cause we're gonna set him to two that way and then he'll be dead next turn. Almost guaranteed. Yeah, very inefficient, but at this point we're, we are changing from like an efficiency strategy to just a kill our opponent strategy. Poison gas. Alright, well, it looks like he's going to poison one of my dudes, and then we're gonna die. Or rather, he's gonna... I forget, does willpower double it, or does it just do one? Or one more? Oh, it doubles it. Okay. Okay. Well, 
We drew right claw, left claw. Let's combo. Let's combo. Right claw, left claw. Go! Super slash. Man. What happened? Did I just like... Were all of my opponents in the first half of in, like the first episode just like super unlucky? Or like... Did they just like ramp up like what they were doing? Oh sweet, I got a Naga counter and a fire dash and a reflect. Um, wrong button. Start it. Just to clarify, B is the menu, and start is just a random thing that is not the menu. I don't understand why, but that's just the way they set it up. All right. Okay. Hi there, buddy. It is our fate to meet here. Let's ban. I don't think I've ever met a child who talks like that, but that's okay. While this thing plays, I'm gonna go and. Grab a little bit of water. Hopefully that's not too gross. The sound of my gulping. And I am the last, again. I think I can count on my... I can count on one hand the number of times that I am the first. Okay. So I have... I have... Well, click jump back wall. Okay, so let's think about what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna tail lash him. And we're probably gonna left claw. So that means that kick isn't gonna get used and jump isn't gonna get used, so we can just ingust those. And that is totally fine. And he's gonna guts all up, isn't he? Oh four, okay, that's still quite that's still a substantial. Substantial amount of gutsage. So we're gonna tail lash. This guy? Looks like he didn't defend, so my wolf should be able to kill him next turn. And I hope at some point I will be able to get more monsters. Because, I don't know, the fact that it's like after every battle you get three cards. Uh, that's, not a, that's not a whole lot, right? In the, uh, uh, one second. In the uh, Yu-Gi-Oh games. It would, <laughs> it would always be, uh, at least you get a pack upon beating someone, um, and that's just been steadily increasing over time, where, like, in the GBA ones, you just got one pack, in the, in the, uh, whatever you call it, in the GX one on the DS, I think you got, like, enough for two or three packs, and then this eventually cascaded into... Uh, where, like, the World Tournament 2010-2011, you'd be able to buy, like, at least, like, five or six packs, if not more, uh, off of just a single duel. Uh, okay, so I guess we're gonna Scratch and Tail Lash. And we're gonna lead off by Scratching, uh, Galley. Looks like it's fine, so that then we'll tail lash it. Yep. <laughs> that is a big stone golem. I'm just noticing. I kinda wanna use him. He seems kinda fun. What was Naga? Naga seems pretty fun. Like, there's these poison attacks and like these, uh, these like physical like counter stuff. That seems kinda cool. In any case. We're gonna end. I'm just gonna guts everything, because I'm gonna get something that deals one. I am absolutely sure. First, we're gonna get kicked. I don't know who he's kicking. Probably, uh, Suizo. Oh, no, he kicks the other galley. Okay. Alright. Now that I think about it, um, Suizo, right? Here, let me pull him up really quickly. He's kinda like, um... He looks kind of like one of those, like, yokai, right? Like a, one of those Japanese ghost spirit things. I, I think I've seen this, like, motif before, where it's a, just a mono-eyed ball with a big set of mouth of teeth and tongue or whatever. Um, it seems very familiar, in any case. That was the point of that. Uh, let's kick our opponent, I guess. Um... I can use Stab next turn. I'm actually pretty happy with that. 
Uh, actually, ooh, 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 if things work out really nicely, I can go and kick that. He just defends, so I, okay, I guess I wasted my thing. Defends by defense! What does defense do? I guess it, like, makes him resist some damage or something. I wanted to do that so I could stab him next turn and then just draw into an answer for Galley. But I guess that didn't happen, so we're gonna... Uh... I wanna keep Stab. Stab is such an efficient card, but... I have to draw into... No, 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 no. no. We're gonna Guts up. Alright. You got stuff too. Yeah, I got tactics. And I got a horn. And I got a lake, so I can just absolutely ruin my opponent's day. Or I got tongue. How much do tongue does a whole lot, right? Tongue is damage six. Cause the enemy breeder guts by three. Oh we are totally tonguing that golem. Alright, Suizo. Do your thing. Yep, let's kill it. Now we can horn him, and he should die. There we go. Good game. See, this one I was like entirely in control. Like, again, that's mostly on my opponent for being stupid. And also having three less health on all of his guys. But, still. Oh, I got computing, and I got willpower, and I got another lie down. You know, I feel like you shouldn't be able to get duplicates. Especially this early on, right? That, like, and I don't mean, like, duplicates in general. I just mean, like, stuff that I already have three of. I, I think I started the game with four lie downs, which is more than you could ever, ever need. Heh, <laughs> you want the treasure. It's difficult to beat me. I do want the treasure. I don't know why you spawned over there, but... Alright. I'm gonna have to deal with these guardians. I'm not sure what these things are in the continuity of of Monster Rancher Battle Card, but... Yeah, Tactics is never gonna get used. Uh, Side Roll I don't think I'm gonna use either. At least not uh, for this sort of thing. Alright. Oh man, he's gonna Mango. Who's he gonna Mango? He mangoes his Golem. It's probably good because his Golem is super strong. Alright, and then he's guessing everything, okay, or mo most things, not everything. It's a little bit annoying that I didn't draw into, like, another left claw or something that's a little bit more efficient. But I guess... Alright, we're gonna spit. We're gonna spit his Suizo. The Suizo has, like, no defenses. And then, what we're gonna do is, we're gonna nix, we're gonna nix all of this, I think, unless we wanna try and lick. Which might, oh, lick might be a good call. Um, what's it? It's a smart. I do kinda wanna do that. The lick, this licking it was so good. Alright, you know what, we're gonna do it. We're gonna... Bet it all on the lick. Uh, I hope that Suizo just doesn't get one shot. Kiss! Oh my god, what is that? Oh god, that's even worse. He's gonna cut my stuff, isn't he? Man! <sighs> this is why I don't like... I don't like fighting against Suizo. He's such bullshit. Um... So I have- I think I have to use the horn to punch him in the face. Oh, and I should've- that means I should've done the right claw last turn. Okay. Alright, we made a mistake. I forgot about the fact that Suizo has bullshit. Um... Okay, now the only question is do I try to lick again? I kinda wanna try and lick! <laughs> Even though it's probably bad. But at this point, it's personal. I wanna- I wanna... Like, mega out-tempo him. Just because he fucked me up last turn. Oh my god. This is actually the most frustrating thing to deal with. Because I can't... God! <laughs> okay. Alright, fine. This is how this is gonna happen, huh? Okay, we're gonna horn. Please, though. Oh, he's dead. 
god. This is what it feels like to be the AI. And I'm playing Suizo bullshit. Oh my god, that's so frustrating. <laughs> okay, we're gonna tail lash, I guess. I don't know, I kinda like tonguing. Let's think about it, right? So by tail lashing, I basically have to do all nix all this so that I have four guts, and then we might be able to draw into a kill. Or I could just tongue him and absolutely fuck him up. And I like that. I like that plan. So we're gonna just tongue him and fuck him up. I think that's a good plan. If you look at it, right? Even though they, even though I. I don't know, I mean, I went second, so I'm not sure how the math works. Also, I think is dead, because that kick does a lot of damage. Um, yeah, okay. Never mind, Tongue is, Tongue is, Tongue Dream is dead. Um, man, that's really frustrating. Nothing, no, nothing went right. <laughs> nothing went right this, uh, this time. And they keep on drawing Squeezo cards, which is that's just a kick in the teeth right there. Uh, I guess we'll try and scratch that. Oh, it's too bad. It's too bad. Uh, uh, hey, at least at least we're learning from this. Oh, I can't breed her again. So I guess I guess I'll just mix all this. I need to. I need to draw into wolf cards. I need to draw into galley cards. Galley, or I can get stabbed. That's fine. And that's why I should—I should have kept. I don't know. What, keeping the defense that long is just so not worth it. Right? That yeah, I might as well just. Yeah. I'm not gonna worry about it. We're gonna one-shot his golem though. This nice fire attack. Burn him out. He's dead. And now we're gonna end the turn by dropping the kick and the reflect so that we have a lie down in case Galley gets targeted and then we have the flame to finish him off next turn. If I don't get targeted. And I didn't, so we're gonna just kill him now. Bye bye. Bye bye. Man. This game seems very swingy. Now that I've played a few more games of it, where shit can just go wrong so fast. Alright. Oh, is the gu the Guardian is a flower. Oh my god. That's- that just makes it extra creepy. Why are we playing a children's card game against a freaking flower? That doesn't make any sense. I want to try your real strength? Not really, I kind of just want to pass through here. You know, can I, can I... Oh, okay, <laughs> I can just phase through them if I hold down long enough. Um, oh, hey, here's a nice treasure chest. Coin tails! What? What? For battle, trick coin with tails on both sides. Will be tails every time. <laughs> this isn't even some meta thing. This is just, oh yeah, you want the treasure? I already got the treasure. What the hell is your problem? I already got the treasure. Please, let me leave. I I've been playing the, I've been playing so many games of this. I'm on the second floor of the basement. I just want to leave. Okay. Okay. Well, this is good. That's not very good. Uh, I don't think willpower will be particularly good either. So I guess I'll just do it like that. Yeah. Oh no, we're getting left clawed. Owie. Not really hurt. Why would you do such a thing? Why are you keeping three cards in your hand? Oh my god. Now that that's the real mystery right there. What the hell is this person doing? Um, no, 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 no. We're going to combo it with four. There we go. 
I'm gonna do... I'm gonna do that on that so that he's just insta-dead. Alright, tire clock, right claw, horn! It teleports and then there's a little poke. Alright, um... Guess I'll kick this loser. Um... Kick the... Kick the cute girl. That seems like a good option. Option. I don't. Need, I don't remember what her card art is. We'd have to. You know, we're gonna have to judge really quickly whether it's whether it's a cute monster or if it's just like. Eh, that's okay. There's something around her lips that looks kind of weird. Well, I think that's just the GB palette being weird. Yeah, that's not a pixie. That <laughs> just demon horns and bat wings. And is also clearly wearing like a torn caveman dress bra thing. Okay, that that <laughs> um that's not what that is. I guess that's just freaking Nintendo of America or whatever or Namco. I don't remember who make who makes this game. Tecmo of America doing their good work to uh, shield the youth of America from such scandalous things. Well, on the bright side, our opponent is super dead because I drew quite well. Um. Oh god, he's rolling! <laughs> That's hilarious! <laughs> That's super hilarious. Okay, I should have I should have scratched first to test for that, but you know what? I think it was worth it. I think I want a Mochi on my team. Mochi seems like a sweet guy. I could get like a Mochi and... I could just like go like Max Japanese, right? And go get like a Mochi and a, a, a Suezo and like... I don't know. I need to look at the rest of them, but maybe like a... Maybe maybe the sucky bits for, for uh, a dramatic effect. There's no reason to keep these. Alright, slap me. Slap me. I love how he poses when he slaps, like he does like a little uh, slide with his uh, legs and I don't know. It, it just shows he cares, man. That guy cares about style. Alright, we're gonna have to help first. Yep. I don't know what we do when we help, I guess we just have like a little pistol or something. I'm gonna bolt him, he should be dead. Oh man, that's the... AI playing around stuff. That's pretty impressive. Because I know, even in the GBA games, the Yu-Gi-Oh! AI was somewhere between awful and just actually horrible. Um, yep, just keep on gutsing. Yep. We're gonna just get punched by his breeder. So I just got shot in the head. Um... And we're gonna get, he's gonna get slapped too. Maybe he'll slap the wolf. Yeah. God, I love that. I I, I love Mochi so much now. This is something super charming about him. All right, we're gonna try and stab our opponent. Come on, no more wolf. There we go. No more defense. Go. Oh. Now, it's kind of an annoying thing. I mentioned earlier in the video that the dodges only work if your specific guy gets targeted. So in the early stages, it's, it's not worth it to keep a dodge because there's only a 1 in 3 that your guy will get targeted. W chop. Throw away. Okay, sweet. I got lots of golem stuff. Alright. Uh, what's our... Okay, so we're about to hit the exit. Assuming that this connects, it doesn't! We gotta go this way. Okay. We just did it here. What's up with this guy? Yeah, what's up with the guys who don't want to battle? And then who just stick around after the battle? That's kind of weird. Um, but... Let me just double check. I've been... I've checked out the whole area. I haven't found his brother. I guess I didn't talk to everyone, but like... 
I think his brother would probably stand out in some way, so I'm gonna go downstairs. There's a chance that he's in this floor anyways, so hopefully I didn't just fuck everything up and make myself have to go through this again. Oh, hey there. Miss, will you play with me? Okay. Alright. We've been going for a while. But we have to at least find the dude before we continue. Hey, I'm the first! For like the first time in forever. <laughs> well, this is interesting. I have a lot of claws that I can just use right at the beginning. So why not use them? Uh, let's kill the wolf. Like, I'm kind of curious to see what, more of what the succubus has, if she has any interesting cards. Right. See if she has a role other than, like, dealing damage. And I guess we'll just, uh, nix these three. That's yeah, fine. Thought we're gonna get punched. I'm not sure how a dinosaur punches with those tiny, tiny arms, but he does. Look at dinosaur. Oh, we're gonna get scratched by the succubus. Oh god. We're the pixie. Yeah, okay, she even has a devil tail. You cannot call that a pixie in any stretch of the imagination. I, I'm I'm sorry. I appreciate all that you do, um, Tecmo of America, but That's just that's not what that is, man. And I am sorry that you think it's it needs to be done, but it's it's not. <laughs> it's not what that is. Alright, we're gonna Tail Lash. Yep, yep. Just keep on punching them. I don't know. I will say, I do think that these Zero Guts cards are useful. It's just... I don't know. I think I need to... Once this dungeon is over, I'm gonna think about how I want to build this build this deck in this game. What sort of things I want to do and like how I how like where essentially like the explosion points should be and stuff like that. Um I don't really want a horn so we're gonna just um nix everything. See what happens. Yep. He's keeping three cards, I have no idea why. I I don't know what could be worth it for three. Uh, do I even want to scratch him? No, this thing is more useful as a guts. There we go. So now I can g do this either with bite or flame next turn. No, no, he helped. The breeder helped out. He punched my wolf in the face. Not very cool. Alright. Uh, let's... Bite him. But if this gets blocked, which is oh god, it looks like it might get blocked. I was gonna say like it might be able to do something else. Like assuming that endure works like in Pokemon, right? Like, he'll just live with one. Well, I guess that's good enough because I don't have anything to deal with that. Um, just keep the attack. Um, yeah, oh yeah. Okay, he's dead. Bolt. Jump aside! Oh my god, stop dodging! Stop dodging, it's so annoying! Uh... I can't use help to deal the final blow. Don't really want to use the mango, either. Alright, fine. I'm gonna do everything like that. Punch my dude if you want. It means less guts for your defenses later. Alright. Oh god, he kept a guard. Alright, well... Let's horn him. Okay, we made it, boys. Killed... This random little girl. I don't know, I guess this isn't so bad. Each battle's only like, maybe five minutes. If I'm fast about it. 
one, I got a back roll, and I got a charge, and I got a left claw. I wish... They keep on giving me all these cards for these for the guy that I already have, but I wish that... Making all the, there were new cards for this guy, not just like cards that I already own, you know? Like, it's fine, give me tiger cards, but give me like... Those are the ones I don't have. That would be nice. Okay, yeah. Weird crossroads. I have no idea how I'm supposed to get across the floor there. Downer! Yay! Um, I guess I should check the rest of that room for... Or not. You want the treasure. I kind of just wanted to double check that I didn't miss the dude, but this is fine. I'll play against the flower. This is just gonna happen, I guess. Game start. Okay. Okay, I am never gonna use both of these hordes. I am not gonna use a willpower. Alright, looks good to me. Attack stuff. And try kicking his, his succubus. Hopefully it dies. Yay! I love killing. And murder. I don't know. There are so many questions I have about this game. Not like the card game anymore. Now this is just all metagame stuff like so We are clearly in a world where monsters exist. We're like mon we are like in the Monster Rancher universe. We are just also in a timeline where little kids wanted to monster ranch but they couldn't, and so instead they just made a very strange card game. So that they could get to know monsters better. Or something. I don't really this is a ve honestly a very strange. Wow, this hand fucking sucks. I think tactics sucks now that I think about it, because you have to spend three guts to get a card back, and then you have to spend guts to get that card going again. Right, if I remember that correctly, it's... Reclaim one from dump card. You don't even get to use it, so that's just super stupid. I'm, not, I'm never going to use that. Um... I guess I'm happy to use a left claw to just kind of chip away at the dinosaur, because the dinosaur is the real damage dealer. He's the real fucker here. So we're going to have to deal with him. And then we are going to have to... Uh, I don't know. I guess I can keep the reflect just because I have so much MP, so much guts. And, like, I do kind of want... Uh, galley to be alive if I draw a flame or something. Roll attack. Oh, well you're targeting me so I can reflect. Smart skill only. I hate this goddamn card. Okay. You're getting rolled. Well, that was a waste of my mana. Alright, we're gonna use flame to just completely kill his, uh, his mochi, and then we'll keep it going. Boom. Uh, I guess I'm also okay just using help to poke him. Alright, guys. Excuse my yawn there. Uh, because we just want it to... Yeah. Yeah, no, this will be fine. And the turn and blitz. Nah. We're, we're we're so close to winning though. There's no point in doing that. Flame. This dinosaur also breathes fire. Wait, don't, isn't my attack also called flame? Except it does more. That's weird. All right, well, opponent's dead. 
hopefully. Yep, left claw, right claw. Easy game, easy life. Yep. Left, right! <laughs> That's a cute little bit. Alright, lose, win. Alright, stupid flower, get out of my way. I'm trying to find this dude who's been lost for like two weeks. Which probably means that he's just not alive anymore, right? Because like, dehydration and all that. But... I guess I don't really care about that. I'm just trying to find him. Oh, God. Oh, God, why are... Oh, so are these little sprouts where flowers can spawn? I think it is, so I'm just gonna dodge these spots from now on, because I already get enough. <laughs> I've played like 12 games of this thing. <laughs> In this episode alone. Oh my god, I want other things to happen. I want to play other games, I want to have other things occur, you know? <laughs> this is, this is a bit too much. All at once. Okay, this is gonna be one of those games. We're gonna spit his Sweezo because I don't want any fuckery happening. Spit. Right claw, horn. Call me Sweezo. He should die. And then immediately it costed me a lot of resources. I... That's okay. It's for the greater good. So I don't have to deal with Suizu. So bad. That's not a... That's not a word. I, so bad. I've never seen that. Um, okay. And we get slapped, okay. It's fine, everything is going according to plan. We have this beautiful stab that we can do. Uh, I don't think, yeah, no, scouting's not worth it. Yeah. Wait, why did I, why did I stab him? He, I, <laughs> I, I, there were thoughts occurring in my head, but I didn't, I was clearly not thinking enough. Um, <laughs> just happened. Okay, uh, we're gonna end the turn. I kind of want to keep spit because it's efficient, and then we'll just end the turn there. Okay. Yeah, I'm not quite sure what happened there. Um, there was something that was happening in my brain and something that was happening on screen, and they did just not line up. Okay. Tiger attack, stab. Oops, excuse me. Alright, we won. Yes. So, thanks for giving me golem cards, but I'm kind of just looking for this- No, 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 I am not- Oh, hey! That guy! That guy looks like him. Looks like a soldier, but it looks like the guy I'm looking for. Cox! <laughs> These runes are always different, so I got lost. <laughs> thanks, Cox. I thought I could get out! My brother sent you to help me, I guess he couldn't wait. Will you take me out? Take me to the exit. Don't leave me. Okay. Not the stair reversed. Um, I guess I can go back. I don't remember how I got here. I guess it's down that way, so let's go there. Have this guy follow me at a respectful at a respectful distance whenever I turn. This path, the pathfinding is clearly not uh, uh, super ideal in this game. It's trying. Uh, oh, good timing. Would you battle with me? I'm trying to escort an elderly man out of this ruins. Okay, you little shit. I'm trying to. Whatever. All right, I am the last. Well, at least I can speed up the whole point, but it feels like I'm always the last. I think I've mentioned that earlier, but it really does feel like I am always the last. 
uh, these are never gonna be used. Yep. Alright, he guts up a whole bunch. Okay. So the spit incentivizes me to scratch plus horn something, which, even though it's hilariously inefficient, means that I get to kill his Suizo before it does anything bad. Now I know most of the time it doesn't do bad stuff, because most of the time I have Suizo. He doesn't do bad stuff. But my opponent also has four guts. I just do not want to... I don't, I don't want to even risk Suizo pulling some bullshit on me. Alright. Well, on the bright side, looks like we're gonna get out. Maybe only takes, uh, I don't know, maybe ten more minutes, hopefully. And then with that, we can probably call it a part. Unless, you know, somehow, I just get stopped. THWACK! Uh-oh! <laughs> oh my god, I just got THWACK. It's a really... Oh, nice callback to Dragon Quest. I don't even know if it was anglicized as Thwack now. I think it was called something else, or like Poof or something. But Thwack is the instant kill spell. Oh god! Speaking of instant kill, like, Suizo is dead. Well, that's good. Um. Well, at least I didn't draw any Suizo cards. We got right claw, left. Oh! 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 Oh, the combo. I just kind of want to see what it looks like. Right claw, left claw. Horn! Use! Uh, kill the Naga! This is definitely not efficient, but I want to see it. Right claw, left claw, horn! Do it! <laughs> he has three animations in a row. Let's go. It didn't take up my guts. Uh, okay, and then we'll just get it. So that if we draw stuff, we can play stuff. Alright, he's gonna thunder me. Um. I don't know, I'm not to the point where I'm gonna be animation canceling quite yet. If I ever decide I need to grind in this for some reason that I'm sure is beyond me even now, then yeah, we'll turn it off and... I don't know, if it looks like these things are taking too long, then we'll definitely do it, but uh, yeah, this looks fine, right? Like, it's not like every game takes 10 minutes. It's like every game takes like 5 minutes. Which is not too bad. One! I got charge, I got thwack, I got counter! Okay, and our... Well, stairs, up. Uh. Yes! We're getting the hell out of here. Uh, is it the same map? No it isn't, because of course it... <laughs> They've been blocking me! Oh god, I don't want to go that way, I don't want to go that way. Too many people, too many people. Uh, hey, you're, you're, you're with me. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay. What? There wasn't even a sprout tile there! Okay, alright, fine. Let's battle you. Yeah, yeah, the Guardian is taking the first attack. So I go second, which means that I get out-tempoed on the second turn, and... Ugh. So neither of these cards are gonna get used. Alright, we're getting scratched, but that doesn't matter. Yeah, pixie, yes. Alright, and we're gonna get left clawed by the tiger. Sweet! So, oh, yes. Well, at least he's spending his turn dealing one damage instead of stocking up for just like a major bullshit later. Okay. So, let's think about this. Okay, so we can kick and right claw. I think it's actually a fine starting point. Let's kick that. We can also right claw it. And spawn that little foot there. There. And then right claw. And then I think the plan is after that, deal with Swayzo. Because I just want to get this kill off early so that he can't keep on using the wolf to kill me. Alright, I can end, got up, we're done. Spit, that's annoying. I think my wolf might actually be dead. 
Or, never mind, he's not attacking that. It's gonna help. Oh man, the brooder really helped there. Just putting in one. Okay, we got some that. Okay! Well, if I could chain both of these, that would be nice, but each monster can only attack once. So I think the play is we're gonna left claw on him. Uh, I mean, four is the break point for tongue, right? I don't want him to tongue me. On the other hand, I. Yeah, no, I. I don't want him to tongue me, but. At the same time, that the odds of specifically tongue just off the top are so low that I'm happy doing a spit and then writing everything in. Boom, spit on the girl. Spit on the succubus, maybe she'll, she'll do something. And then we're just gonna... I don't care if, if Molly dies or what's his name? Gally. Golly. Alright. Yeah, we lose one. That doesn't... Alright. Got Oh man, I guess it did matter because I didn't get one more damage. Well. And spit. Spit in his face. Let's do it. Patui. I mean, I guess we can drop the help just that he's down to one. Scratch does it, right? Stuff like that. Playing to our outs and all that. And he's not going to be able to do enough that I don't want to just think that's all these things. I can drop a help. Ah, punch my wolf. Owie. Okay, I need to, yeah, no. it, it, It's over. Yeah, it's over. Let's just horn him. Horn! Nice job. Lose and win. Alright. Okay, I'm getting a lot of golem cards. If I could get golem as like a dude, that would be pretty sick. Um, this is not the right way. Hey, you coming, buddy? <laughs> I didn't even enter the room! I. <laughs> I didn't even enter the room, and he spawned right in front of me. That is so stupid. I keep on going second. I want to know what it's like to go first. Oh my god. Yeah, another one of these. So many of these are things that I'm not going to be able to use. Um, I guess you can use this bit. Eh. Okay, so I'm not going to use those. Player attack set. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do your stupid shit. That's what it is. Come on, come on. Well, I got horn. I can horn spit and then nix everything else. He's pretty good. Do it against his. So that he. Because Wolf has access to a lot of easy dodges and a lot of bullshit, so I don't want him, don't want him to be able to, you know, do that. Come on, Horn. There you go. There you go. He's dead. Got everything else, and then we are nice and prepared for turn three or whatever. Turn two. No, it's turn three. Oh, I got, I'm getting Kappa slapped. Mochi. I like how he also closes his eyes when he when he does it. When he does his stupid slap, I think that adds a lot of character. Um. Okay, well we can mega fuck him up right now. Let's do that. Step. What? You have a zero mana dodge. Okay, there's gotta be a catch, because zero mana dodge is actually... That's 
so nuts. Um, well, it, oh, one or more guts. Everything's gonna consume one or more guts. That's so good. Ugh. All right. I feel slightly cheated, but not, but not particularly. All right. Let's just try and kill that pixie there. All right. And look, pretty standard ending. All right, he's gonna roll attack. I have no deck cards available. Oh god. I just want to leave now. <laughs> I just want to leave. Is there no like fast travel thing that I can do? All right, spit. Ah, you're gonna be annoying, aren't you? Everything costs one. How do you? How do you not? Okay, Bolter. I want him dead. I want this stupid succubus dead. There we go. Okay. Okay, he's gonna use the help, and then that's probably just gonna be it. I think I'm actually gonna take the helps out of my deck, because I'm never thrilled to draw them. It's a one for one, that's not particularly efficient. Even if I can do it whenever. That's just not. I think it's not particularly worth it. Especially because it costs a card, right? So. Card and guts are basically the same unit of measurement. So basically, okay, no kill, like overkill. Uh, basically, everything is actually in terms of card units. Everything costs one more than its guts cost, and a two for one is really bad, right? Two two cards for one damage is super super awful in my opinion. At least, like, two cards for two damage is, like, okay. Right? Chop. Chop. Clutch. Okay. I'll just grab the treasure, because I guess I'm here. Um. This isn't the right way. Is it? Come on. Come on. What the heck is wrong with you? I don't want the treasure! I just want to get out of here! I'm looking for the exit, you stupid flower! <laughs> Please let me go. Let me leave. My voice is tired. Okay. You know you know what? We're gonna we're gonna find the stairs and I'm just gonna <laughs> I'm gonna have to call it there. Um Let's get rid of those mangoes, those are gonna be this one. Okay, give your give your guy a mango. Feel better about it. Just please stop. Man, at some point I would like to go first. That seems like it might be very strong. Well, he has no other cards, so while he has no other cards, I might as well just kill the succubus. Do a little tail ash. Then we're gonna do a little right claw action. Come on. Come on. There you go. There you go. I'm getting hungry, man. Like, I thought I was gonna go for like an hour and then I could go and grab some dinner. Now. <laughs> it's an hour and a half. Oh my god. Clutch. Oh god. Golem coming in clutch. I have like all the golem cards now because I keep on fighting these stupid guardians. I thought they were supposed to be rare encounters. It would be more challenging. But the only difference is that you just always go last so that you have less variety. <laughs> oh god. Okay. Um. I guess we'll just spit on Mochi. Um, yeah, spit and then scratch him. 
and then I'll get rid- uh, I don't really like Holy Ray. I don't think it's particularly good. Um, I mean, like, it's fine. It's a 4 for 2 that can't be blocked. That your opponent knows that it can't be blocked, so it's not like they're gonna waste a block on it, so it just sucks. And that does. I do want to keep my wolf around though, so. Pedal Wind! So we're gonna back roll. Oh, Pedal Wind's an AoE, I guess. Yeah. Mochi attacks! Ooh! So I guess it hits all of them? I'm not sure why it repeats the animation, whereas like Flame Wall did it once. Maybe there's some special effect about it. I don't know, because I don't have that card, and I don't think I have Mochi. Or, like, I won't be able to get Mochi for a while, so... Alright, let's... Kick Mochi in the face. And then just prepare a bite, so that then hopefully we can win very shortly. Uh, can I actually prep bite? No, I can't. Um... And yeah, I can't quite grab that. We're just gonna in guts everything and hope that I can grab something good. Ah, oh, Clutch! Oh no! Oh no, he's dead. And I hope I don't draw like a tongue or something. Those stabs do hurt a little bit to draw, I will say. But we're making it work. We are making it work. I think I drop the help because I'm gonna nix everything right now. Yep. Or maybe I'll keep the light down or whatever this guy is. No, I'm not keeping Blakeful. Oh, yep. Oh man, that's a lot of guts. Alright, try biting him. Should work. Looks like it did. Bite. Ow, nom, nom. <laughs> okay. Okay, are we done fighting these stupid flower motherfuckers? They're like, you won, go ahead. I got more golem cards, yay! That's kind of nice getting the golem cards. I, I kind of just want to leave. Okay, maybe it's this way? No. Uh, maybe not. Oh! No, not this way. No, this person is in the way. Alright, so we're gonna have to go around the long way. Come on. Where is it? Oh, we're at the exit, we're at the exit. Oh, thank god. We're going upstairs. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> One more. Okay. Okay. Gotta be careful. Get out of the- Get out of this room. I don't want the treasure. Is there an option to say no, I don't want the treasure? <laughs> okay. But this is just gonna have to happen, I guess. I- is just <laughs> it keeps on going that's really the annoying part this is like the first dungeon and it takes like three hours to complete that's absolutely insane um you, you, you can't do that i guess i'll tail lash uh his much easier Kind of cut back on things. I just, I'm so tired of this, man. I want to change my deck up and like use other monsters, but we can't use other monsters until we get back from this, and then we go to like the weird shrine thingy and deal with 
Whatever stupid problem they were having. Alright. <laughs> yep, okay, we're gonna get clutched. Golem's coming in clutch. I'm gonna have like 80 golem cards by the end of this episode. Kinda like this is so surreal because this game almost actively like disincentivizes you from going and finding treasure because you don't want to deal with the flower guardian appearing every single freaking room. Um, do I try to tongue? I think I try to tongue because it's like six damage, right? We tried a tongue, I think. Because then, that basically closes out the entire game. Yeah, it, it's over. We're gonna tongue him. He's gonna have no guts. Or he's gonna have fewer guts. Because he has so much guts already. Um, we're gonna use these to just kind of kill him. Horn! Punch him! Hit him for three. Okay. Uh, and... And guts. Okay. You're not gonna do anything, that's fine. Just die and... God, I can't kill him this turn. Why can't I kill him this turn? It's very frustrating. I didn't really want to get that, but that doesn't really matter. Oh wait, what what was that? Evil shots? I wasn't paying attention. Did that do oh god. What just happened? I was going too quickly. Um uh close. Close. Evil shots. This is a six for eight. Even if dodged the damage is half. Oh, that's pretty good. Ensure that you're not wasting things. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll just run them. Please die. And Gally, Golly, maybe it's Golly, because it's like a weird tribal thing, so be Romanized like that. Okay. Another five minutes down the drain. You've won, go ahead. Oh, God. So many Golem cards. I have like 20 co copies of Golem. Um. I'm gonna drop a save. Uh. Okay, why would the fucking exit be? Okay, it's right there. Uh. Do I have to wait for him? Okay. Yes. Okay, we made it. Thanks for a great job! Drop in later, I want to give you something. See you then! Okay, who is this? This runs away. This is the same thing. Yeah, okay, this is the same spiel he gave. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Alright. We're going back to Aurora. Or I guess, um, we can talk to that dude now. Oh, hey, it's a game board. Oh, it's you. My brother's back. Thanks. I'll make you something at the studio for a reward. If you find paint in the ruins, I'll make you more cards. Paint? Welcome to the cards. Do you have the old paint? No, I don't. What? Cool. Wait. Where the heck do you get old paint? I didn't find any old paint. I have, like, 30 cards. Freaking downer S's, but I don't. <laughs> what does the mural pieces do? What... Yes, I, I. Okay. Basement six. I'm never gonna be able to make it to basement six. What the hell is this? Roker. 
that priest make a, makes a mistake like that and gets mad when others mess up. Oh, God, what's... Oh, these are the murals, I guess. Well, there's this weird church. Johannes. This is the sacred god shrine. Oh, mighty one, bring Cox home. Oh, hey, I did bring Cox home. I was like, oh man, what do I do now? Tiger's not here either, after all the care I took raising him. What the hell is it? What is this place? They... Please, everyone, where is get our battle cards? Hey, I'm trying to pray here. Keep out of the way. Wow, this is... <laughs> this is kind of weird. Um, who are you? Cammy. Oh, 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 we have a nice little nun there, I guess? Colon <laughs> nun. You're a con breeder, right? Let me tell you something. That picture is a holy picture found in the first rune. Get all this world's cards and a certain item and see a miracle. Um, I don't know if we're going to get every card in this game. Welcome, welcome to the sacred card shop. We generate monster cards from discs here. Oh my god. Can't go in there. Oh my god, I already talked to Cody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, whatever. Maybe Cox has a reward. I understand. I understand, Cody. I understand. Alright, you know what? I'm actually gonna say screw it. I'm gonna call it a part here. My wolf is very tired. I've been going for an hour and 40 minutes. Jesus Christ. So. Yeah, I think there are like maybe 20 games in there or something stupid. Hopefully you found them. At least some of them interesting. Uh, especially towards the beginning when I actually talked about the game sort of as a meta. Hopefully that was kind of cool. Um, yeah, I'll try to get out one more episode this week. And then after that I will consider my debt to Society Repaid and I will, you know, go back to a once a week schedule. Just because that works out the best. Okay. Uh, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. Hopefully I'll see you in a couple of days.